Instead of giving commands one at a time in the command bar, we can provide a list of commands in a special object called a script. A script is basically a text file that we can insert code into that'll run when the game starts. Let's add a script to change the color and transparency of the base plate. To add a script, right click on Server Script Service, hover over Insert Object, and then click on Script. The script will automatically open in a new view. If you close the script, you can always open it again by double clicking on the script in the Explorer. Let's delete the code that is in the script by default and start working on the base plate. Just like we did in earlier videos, we first have to tell the script to look inside of Game, then inside of Workspace, then Base Plate. We then type the property we want to change, in this case the transparency. We then set the value by typing equals and the value we want, say 0.5. We can then make a new line by pressing Enter and start typing a new command. So let's change the base plate's color by typing game dot workspace dot base plate dot brick color equals brick color dot blue and open and close parentheses. Now unlike commands in the command bar, code in a script won't run until the game runs. We can run the game by clicking on the home tab and then pressing the play button. We can see as soon as the game starts that the base plate is transparent and blue. When we hit stop, the game reverts to the state before the script ran.